Hey guys, welcome to this video. Uh, my name is uh, Francois, and if you are watching this video, which you are, it's because you want to know the resources that you can use to be able to prepare for the CompTIA uh, Advanced Security Practitioner uh, Certification, also known as the CASP Plus Certification. So I have links to the resources that I use to prepare for the exam, but before I talk about that, I want to give you my true reasons why I went for this certification in the first place. So reason number one is because I have other CompTIA certifications. So I have A+, Net+, Security+, uh, CISA+, Linux+, although Linux does not expire. But with uh, the thing about CompTIA is that when you take the upper level certification, it's going to renew everything you have under. So my certifications were going to expire this year. I said, you know what? Instead of paying the annual cost of uh, maintaining the certifications, I'm going to take the upper level certification so I can renew everything. Reason number one. Now, reason number two is because I do a lot of teaching. And if you, you know one or two things about IT instructors is that universities or colleges or boot camps, they won't let you teach a certification unless you have that certification yourself. I mean, there is some exception I've seen in the market, but a lot of the, a lot of the universities, they're not gonna let you teach for a certification class unless you have that certification yourself. So for someone who do a lot of teaching like me, it kind of makes sense, really, to kind of just take the certification just in case I wanna teach that certification in the future or for the sake of just renewing everything that I have with the, with the CompTIA. All right, so here's the list of the things that I use to prepare for this exam. So the first thing I used was a book. So I have a book here that I, I bought, you know, kind of uh, helped me prepare. I don't know if you can see it or it's kind of a little bit too bright. But I have a book that I use to prepare. Um, I will leave a link. You can grab a copy on the Amazon. But I also went to Udemy and I purchased Justin Dion's course. So he have a course. He also have a practice in questions. I'll put the link in the description. So I bought that as well. And then I got some other resources from CompTIA themselves. Well, the beauty of being an instructor, sometimes you don't pay for some things. So with CompTIA, they gave me access to their labs, practice in questions, the course, them, uh, the course itself for free. They also gave me a voucher for free. Or, well, hello to the instructors, right? <laughs> um, on top of these resources, I also did a lot of uh, Googling, right? Like Google was my best friend and Reddit, Reddit was also my best friend. So I, I read about uh, reviews of people who have taken the certification themselves. I looked at some of the things that I should watch out for and all that good stuff. So one of the best advice that I would give anybody who is taking this certification would be, to do as many practicing questions as you can. Yes, this is an advanced certification from CompTIA, but remember, this is not a hands-on certification. It's still an exam that is heavily rely on memorization, right? memorizing stuff. So one of the things that I've seen, um, you know, CompTIA kind of a focusing on was more of a, when they asked me the question, it was more like, okay, which one of the following is the best? Or which one of the following is the most, right? And what that really means is that it doesn't mean the other answers are not the right answers, right? They are just looking for the best answer or they're looking for the most answer, right? So that's kind of the tricky part of the certification. That's why I said, do as many of these practicing questions as you can uh, so you can get kind of a familiar with the questions or get familiar with the how CompTIA uh, ask kind of uh, uh, the questions. So that's all I have uh, for this video. If you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing and I'll see you all in the next video.